reduce beef consumption. So red meat is responsible for 10 to 40 times as many greenhouse gas emissions as the production of vegetables and grains. So on my shows, we reduce beef by 100 pounds a week for every week of production. So over the course of four years, that's 40,000 pounds. Less meat, more vegetables, right, Jerry? Yes, <laughs> no beef. No. What's a week beef? <laughs> I didn't really tell people about it at the beginning and I was very concerned that there would be a uproar about people being dictated what kind of food they should eat. And then as we got more familiar with it and we realized how great the other choices were, people started coming up to me and saying that they felt better, that they had more energy, that they were proud to be eating good food at work. When I told them what we were doing and why we were doing it to try and reduce the impact of beef processing, they were thrilled. There are many benefits to reducing beef consumption. Food-related greenhouse gas emissions will drop by two-thirds. It also reduces deforestation and water pollution. Food costs on set will go down. Your health will also benefit by lowering obesity and reducing your chance of heart disease.